right guys welcome back to the channel i gotta grind four stumps today this is a red bud two cedar stumps and i got to do a bradford pear stump over there but the question i get a lot is uh will the stump make a sinko well and what do i do with the uh, stump mulch so that's the two biggest questions i get asked uh from customers when i go to grind them all right so far as the sinkhole if you grind it completely out you won't have a sinkhole but if i grind it three to four inches five inches over a period of time it will sink unless you put down dirt over the top of it and pack it but then again it's still going to sink to an uh, extent so most of the time i try to grind them completely out so um if you're new to the stump grinding business that's what i would recommend try to grind them out and then backfill if you if you tiller around it like in this situation you feel tiller uh, the dirt where it's raised up and backfill it and then take the stump grinder and go over it back and forth it makes a 10 times a better job that one over there being a small stump oh it won't be no problem knock it out and then i'll uh pack the mulch down just because of the size of the stump and like in another situation you would do say if you're building a garage and this is where you want to put a garage you're better off taking a, a hiring a guy with a track hoe and digging it completely out leave the stump about four foot and then where he can grab it and, and uh, do it that way or if it's small enough you can grind the whole he can grind the whole shebang it just depends on the size of the stump on that situation.
Hey guys, if you liked the video, hit the like button and the subscribe button, and I'll see you on the next one.